Most men who are struggling inside their marriage are in survival mode. They seek to protect themselves and to maintain control. They exhibit emotional withdrawal. They shut down emotionally. They avoid intimacy. They don't share their feelings with their partner. They avoid conflict. They avoid confrontations, difficult conversations. They walk on eggshells. It results in unresolved issues that they sweep under the rug that eventually creates resentment. They operate in a constant state of hypervigilance. They're overly concerned and overly sensitive and overly just hyper attuned to conflict, which leads to tension. And that tension leads to a readiness to defend themselves at any given moment. They have controlling behaviors. They try to control their partner's actions, their partner's decisions, their partner's emotions, just to try to maintain a sense of stability in the external around them. They have a lack of trust. They struggle to maintain and keep trust with their wife due to their past traumas and due to the disappointment that they feel inside the relationship, not getting their needs met because they can't be the authentic version of who they are. They have frequent arguments. They, they get in constant arguments because of all these under, unresolved underlying issues that consistently get swept under the rug and they feel neglected inside the relationship. They feel neglected because what they put into the relationship is what they get out of it. And a lot of times they seek validation inside their work or business or their career. So what? They struggle with perfectionism, they avoid vulnerability, and they experience a negative outlook on their life. They're, they're pessimistic and they expect the worst possible outcomes. They catastrophize. Most guys don't realize they operate inside this constant state of survival. And this is why they don't feel fulfillment. This is why they don't feel contentment. Because in order to feel contentment and fulfillment, we have to be living as an expression of the most authentic version of who we are. But see, if I haven't healed and done the work, then I'm guarded and I don't truly know my inner self. And therefore I can't stand in someone else's pain with them because the deeper the pain, the fewer the words, they just want to fix it. They don't know how to just be a presence because they can't stand in their pain. So my brother, I wanna tell you like, if you're in survival mode right now and you recognize that you're operating in a state of survival, recognize where that comes from. And I'm gonna tell you where it comes from. It absolutely 100% comes from things that you have not addressed. And if you wanna break free to the other side, if you want to truly find a connection with your wife that exceeds what you've already had, you have to do that work. And I want to join you. I want to, I want to ask you to join us right now inside this academy. I just released a free training on this. Doing shadow work, doing the inner work to find liberation and freedom. Because you don't have to stay living in survival mode. 